travel to Alfheim. Tyr, you're really up for coming with us? I am. Whenever you're ready. Well, whenever your father's ready, I should say. If my counsel might help you towards the answers you seek, it's the least I can do to repay you. Plus, I think it will do me well to see the light of Elfheim again. Hmm. That elf light is some good shit. Uh... Are we just... Oh, okay. So, where'd this plan come from? Oh, from Mimir, of course. I was merely asking how you found me, and he explained the secret prophecies inside the Yodnar shrines. Fascinating. From there, we sent you taking stock of which shrines we'd seen, at which point your father recalled finding drawers outside the Temple of Light. Companion accessory now, slot? can actually go to Alphite. The prudent course of action became self-evident. Nary a lost step for the world's smartest man. Even without feet, if you'll forgive the levity. I was always fond of her talks, you know? Aye. And it's good to see you a free man again, old friend. Okay. Let's, um... He really did it. Tyr really slept in my broom closet. Is that normal for you tall, godly sorts? Or just the ones locked up for a lifetime or two? And thanks to you as well, Doc. These clothes do better than I deserve. Darn straight! And never mind what brought that... Can't upgrade any of those. Hmm. The landlord? He's not the landlord! <laughs> I kind of like... These ones. Radiant Warden handles uh, the Dauntless Shield. Need more slag deposits. Armor. We're, we're, we, we're still keeping that one. And we can upgrade it. Hey! What happened to all the armor we made you already? I used it. <laughs> well, maybe try to make this one last longer. I will not. Uh, the wrist armor. The Risen Snow Gauntlets. That's what we have right now. And if it was between that one and these ones, right? The Need of Valir. Uh, oh, we wanted to get the Need of Valir, though. But we need Need of Valir. Or... Fuck it. I'll just keep these ones. Huh. That might be my best piece yet today. Very good. Um, and then this waistband. We were wanting this one. But we need need a Valir. Great. I guess Fuck, maybe this does look better. All right. Gonna keep it spatter free this time, right? Kratos? No. Uh Sell. Furious Mall. Actually, let me let me take one more look at that. The Furious Mall. No, we like the one that we've got. Okay. Just stepping outside. Right behind you. I'll meet you at the gateway presently, friends. Excuse me, sir. Mind if I take a little peek at you? I promise I'll be brief. 
What in the fuck? My goodness, what a strapping physique. Capable of an astounding variety of acts of violence. What the fuck is this thing? What is happening? What? This must be the squirrel that tends the world tree. That delectable aroma. Could it be? Pardon the intrusion. Ah, yes. Amber resin. Delightfully nutty with a hint of squidding. No. Not one for gastronomic exploration, I see. Wait, if you're ratted Hosker, why are you so different when we summon you for help? It's a what? long story. <laughs> but you are correct. I am indeed Radit Hosker. The one you know as Radit Hosker is merely one of my spectral aspects. And a particularly nasty one at that. I consider him so far removed from myself that he's practically a different person. Speaking of... Bitter, would you like to come out and see your friends? Fuck off! I'm busy! I suppose that was to be expected. Anyway, now that I've polished off all this resin for you, would you like the seed back? It is the seed. Indeed. A seed of Yggdrasil, huh. to be precise. Since my dwarven tenants performed their little reconfiguration, you'll need seeds like these to open up new destinations on my tree. <laughs> Your tree, huh? Yes, my tree. Here. Let me show you. What in the fuck? <sighs> ah, so that's why good Master Brock needed an alpine seed. Clearly you have important matters afoot. Alfheim awaits with a long and difficult journey. The training grounds of Nilf Niflheim hold secret rewards. Svartalheim, Svartalfheim may hold unfinished business. Choose carefully. We can only do one of the three. That seed you found unlocks Niflheim of all places. A realm as ancient as it is vaguely sticky. So... Wow, it's giving us the option to either go to the next part in our travel or to open up. Svartalfheim remains at your disposal if you have unresolved business amongst the dwarves. What the fuck? So we can't just go back to Svartalfheim? Huh. Okay. For now, we'll just continue to Alfheim. I wonder if it'll let us... Uh... If it'll let it stay unlocked. Perhaps as we travel, you can tell me the tale of your prior visit to the Land of the Elves. Sure I can. Alfheim was the first time we ever realm traveled using your temple. Freya tried coming with us, but Odin cast a spell on her. She can't leave Midgard. That's terrible. So then we fought our way through an army of Dark Elves to get to the light. You interfered in the Elf War. Not by choice. We sought to fill our Bifrost, and they attacked us. And the Dark Elves were covering it with their sticky hive stuff. When we freed it, Light Elves came back. Things seemed better in Alfheim. <laughs> Did they now? Huh. I wonder if the Light Elves were the bad guys. Alfine. It's been so long. Not sure where the temple is from here. But that's where we'll find Groa Shrine. Broken history. Aye. Not exactly an easy fix for that. New rune read. Okay, so we have the Vault. Vault Vista. Don't know what to tell you. Not everything's got a thrilling story behind it. Sometimes people just label things exactly what they are. The Pit Mine. Asgard's Fartalfine Mining Cooperative. I was not the one to coin this particular equivocation, but one has to respect the pure emotionless language that paints over decades of system systemic la slaughter and oppression. 
<clears throat> Broken history. Graffiti in dark elf territory next to a statue of their ancestors, the elves before the division of light and dark. The message being what exactly and for who. Either the elves have seen the statue and ignored it, or they're more concerned with the mastery over the light. Hmm, what do we got about... Okay, we got all those foes. Uh... Friends. It has been too long since Faye left us, and we spread her ashes from the highest peak in Jotunheim. A journey she planned, one that neither of us was ready for. I dreamed of her in simpler times when being together was enough. My duty now lies solely with our son. This is Kratos writing this. So much that I still not, do not understand. I see glimmers of her in Atreus, and they make me smile. But I am left with those same questions as I try to guide him along his path. He is focused on who he will become. And while it becomes difficult to keep him close, I'm grateful I can continue this journey with him for now. Dude, if I was a fucking dad, I'd be crying. I'd be fucking crying. Fenrir the wolf has been in decline for some time now. Atreus cares for the animal deeply and has not been able to accept that he is dying. In the past, I would have told him to close his heart to this loss, but he has already endured so much. I see the compassion in his heart and I am proud of the man he is growing into, but I must keep him focused if he is ready for more dark days ahead. Dude would be straight up crying. Fenrir, Atreus... What did he say about Atreus? Atreus has grown much since our journey to Jotunheim. We've trained through the winter upon winter with no summers in between. He is stronger, more capable, more adept in battle, and an excellent climber. We still have much to learn if he is to master his emotions with discipline. He remains distracted by thoughts of Loki and destiny foretold by the giants. Whatever his mother's people intended for him, whatever she intended, I will keep him safe and prepare him while I can. Brock Sindri. Durlin. Ratatosker. A large and extremely talkative squirrel who claims to take care of the world tree. He is overly familiar, yet seems harmless and benevolent. His spectral aspects have aided us before and may again. So I wonder if those are like, you can use, that was one of the attacks that you could use in the last game. I, know, I don't think I ever used them, like the wolves and stuff. Revealed that the stone given to Atreus by Dinner was a seed for use in realm travel. If he continues to prove useful, I may tolerate his excessive blather. I'm not certain he will prove as useful to us as Atreus hoped, either as a leader or as a source of information, though perhaps with patience he will recover himself. Most importantly, he seeks neither war nor revenge for the suffering visited upon him. In this, I am grateful. Okay, sorry for that little detour. I just wanted to know a little bit of backstory. Um. Let's get going. I see the elves continue their war. Yeah. So much for things being better in Alpha. <laughs> Thimble winter hit Alfheim hard. No. Storms have plagued Alfheim's deserts long before Thimble winter. So this is normal? Hold on. I hear something out there. Something big. It's in pain. Oh, there's a chest down there. I guess they want to go up that way, so we'll just take a small detour. What do you hear? Feels like some kind of animal. How could anything live in a storm like that? Plenty of caves under the desert. Not exactly a paragon of comfort, but the dark elves get on best they can. There's one right there. It's not going to reach, is it? God damn it. Anything else out here? There's one. 
Yeah, won't reach. All right, I gotta get up there. There, the Temple of Light. Roa's shrine is at the top. Well, um, you know these all these doors were connected before, weren't they? Freyr never bothered returning to Alfheim, did he, Mimir? I no. I assumed the fate of his own realm took precedence. Wait, Freya's brother? Yes. Cut from a different cloth, that one. Uh, I guess it's probably not gonna work because. Um. There's a barricade up ahead. What are those shiny rocks? Twilight the guard stone. shut down. A rare material that can take millennia to form. Majestic, isn't it? Occasionally, the light of Alfheim will bind to a rock and crystallize, growing like moss on a fallen tree. Truly a wonder what of the Nine Realms. What the fuck? Oh, I didn't know it could do that. Okay. Oh, very clever. Very interesting. These fucking. Right side, brother! <laughs> These fucking things are disgusting and lame. Freya's brother. How was he involved? Long ago, Freya of the Vanir traveled to Alfheim, where he discovered a once beautiful land devastated by war. Using his divine powers, he set about cultivating a tenuous peace among the elves. Huh. How the fuck did... Did you mention how that piece fell apart as soon as he left? I was getting to it. You hear that? Oh, no. That's enough, please. We don't need to do this. We don't want to hurt you. We do not have a choice. Light elves are attacking us now. <laughs> Whoa, out, out, out. Why are you fighting us? We helped you last time. Atreus, focus. Hey, Alpha. All right, calm down, kid. We don't need you turning into a fucking bear. What the fuck? Fuck yeah. They attacked us. More will follow once we're inside. Is there truly no other way? Not like they're giving us much of a choice. <laughs> so your father said. I'm just naive, I suppose. No. Just an optimist, old friend. Sounds very much like... Jesus Christ. Tribute to Freya, made by the elves. He must have left it here when he raced back to Vanaheim. What is this? A charm to ward off nightmares. In this case, flares. Well, knowing the elves, there are probably more tributes to find. Can we destroy these? No. Best we move on for now, brother. Don't think we have the right tools for huh. this one. All right, fine. <laughs> So tall. We came in from the top last time. Didn't realize all this was even down here. It's an older gate, built to promote cooperation between the elves, but it looks like it's been sealed for some oh. time. How do we enter? 
I assume you turn that one. And I turn this one. I'll go first. Petraeus, let me know when I've reached halfway. So, uh, what's happening right now? This seal is meant to represent the balance of the realm when Freya was here. Light and dark, working together in harmony. How's that look, Atreus? Good, I think. Father, now you go. Unfortunately for Alfheim, Freyr couldn't accept his sister's decision to marry Odin. He returned to Vanaheim and left this realm to its fate. To be fair, the Aesir did set him on fire that one time. Hmm. The door should have opened. Are you sure it's balanced? Yeah, but the realm isn't. Not anymore. Father, try pulling it the other way. Yeah, yeah, and here, you keep pushing forward. What? It's all light elf? Fine work, Atreus. Shall we? So... Maybe that's just to show us that... Maybe if we continue to play in this, the realm will balance out a little bit more. What's a Dark Elf statue doing in the Light Temple? That's just how they looked before the Division. The Division? Yes. The Elves weren't always split between Light and Dark, you know. This statue depicts the elves before the war, before they discovered the power of the light. Oh. Whoa. Yes. The stone briefly imparts a bit of light to your axe. That's useful. What's that sound? No sense in spoiling the surprise. Does Mimir know? Or is that just one of them clever catchphrases? Oh, the light. Oh, oh. Jesus. Oh. I've never seen the Lake of Souls. Oh, so shit. Aye. Fimple Winter, you reckon? Of course. Making the light unstable. So the base of this light well, that's the Lake of Souls. Yes. After the creation of the Nine Realms, fallen souls began to gather down in those waters. When the Elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. Many of them became addicted to their newfound power, and thus, Oof. the Light Elves were born. So this is where Sindri went and fucking... got Brock, huh? Very interesting. I feel like this does something. Nope. And where does that... Right there. Well done. Though I imagine our light elf friends will Well, kind of sounds like they're dickwads anyway, so it'll be fine. Speaking of light elves, let me try talking to them again. They may just to let these two do their thing, brother. <laughs> <laughs> What the? What the fuck? Ah, fuck. Well, I didn't mean to do that, actually. Poor 
our souls. I guess. Weird. They came across on light bridges. But now the bridges are gone. I have an idea to get us across. Lucky for us, swearing off violence doesn't mean he can't disfigure some architecture. This way. The shrine awaits. Okay. Now we're Spider-Man. Kratos, where are you going? He's just looking around. He does this. <laughs> ah, a curious mind. Carry on. I also kind of like when, like, games will... The temple looks so different than I remember. It was all broken and covered in we'll hives that the last time we were here. These elves use Alfheim's light to enhance <laughs> the temple. And themselves, by the look of it. They definitely look more dangerous than last time. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Great. The shrine is this way, Kratos. Yeah, he knows. He just likes to be thorough. Nice like when a, when a game fucking uh, makes note that you... Of like... It. Only gamer like behaviors or shit, you know, like when it's self aware a little bit. I enjoy that. Excuse the fuck out of you, buddy. Can I open this? I wonder. Maybe I can put it behind it. No, I can walk up like this. Damn. Do this. Well, well. God. Fuck you, Odin. Anything interesting this way? It looks like it. Ow. <laughs> attack. Yeah, let's go. We continue? So if these elves use the light to build doors and make themselves stronger, what do the Dark Elves want with it? To return it back to its source. To them, the natural resources of Alfheim are sacred, none more so than the light itself. Aye, the Light Elf's success came at a terrible price. Alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland soon after the creation of this temple. Yeah, it definitely sounds like we fought for the wrong guys, you know? There's more Twilight Stone up there. I can't even look that high. I imagine I have to bounce this off two different surfaces. Maybe. Another of Cavassier's poems. Or this looks like a good angle. Oh. Gotta be a better angle on that fire. More light elves ahead. I'll handle this. Uh, maybe that's not Tear. a great idea. Jesus Christ. Oh there, friends. Salutations. We mean you no harm. Here. To nullify the project. Get back. Whoa. Don't 
fucking axe infused with light. Let's Immediately fucking breaks their posture. You wanna try it? What the? I... What? Kid, why do you have no arrows ready? Using them. That's the long and short of it. Aye. So then, which side is right? Rarely is it so simple. And not our place to say. This is an elven conflict. I said as much the last time we were in Alfheim. He did. Right. I do remember that. <clears throat> do you remember that? Is anyone fucking listening? Sure made a lot of these light doors. <laughs> Fortifications. Aye, none too eager to let the dark elves run the roost again. All right. Guessing that has to be activated somehow. Put back up. There it is. Oh, come on. Can I get it from here? Yeah. Excellent. Let's continue our. Oh, what's under here? I don't think that's the way up to the shrine. <laughs> we know. There's a chest over here. Oh, I see it now. Forgive my impatience. Oh, <laughs> tricky. What? Hmm. Oh. Oh. Clever use of Thanks, your axe, I didn't Kratos. mean to do it on purpose, though. So I guess that's, they kind of make it easy on you. Glad we explored. Um, oh, they definitely no. tell you if something's gonna, if like, right the use of the fucking, holy shit, that fucking hurt. It, uh, it tells you if something's gonna, like, work or not when throwing the axe at those things. Back to it, then. Guess I'm just not gonna get that hellstone. Who needs him? Oh. What? Come on, Kratos. Off your back. I guess that's what I fucking deserve for saying who needs hellstones, right? Are you kidding? Fucking little bitch. Okay, let's go. There's something over here. 
More inspiring lyricism from the mind of Gvasia. Great. I suppose I'll leave you to it. Yeah, sorry, man. Ouch. Oh, fuck. To interrupt an attack. Whoa. I'll just do this. Wow. That was violent. I'll meet you on the other side. That's kind of my whole thing. Tear can really jump. So those things are to knock down like Okay, okay, I see. That's the wrong no. There you go. He's getting the hang of it. I've never seen the light elves with so much control over the temple. Yes, that's on us. We must have anointed a new temple guardian. Battle Yoffa's counterpart. The Dark Elf King. Yes, he's in the light now, too. Where am I supposed to aim this bastard? Can I? It's right there. I don't suppose I can throw my axe. No. So I need it to face me. What the fuck? There's something I'm missing here. Rune engraved to release a simple trinket for signifying rebirth. Does that allow us to reallocate skill points? Yeah, I know. I'm right here, dude. Here they come. Do what you must. Okay. Father, watch the oars. Oh, he's mine. That's you enough. I 
Shit. Ugh. Fuck. I saw it coming. how they're making light bridges. Look at this statue. These crystals. I've noticed them on the elves as well. The crystals on the back. I wonder if this statue were to fall over the chasm. Quite know how that works, but oh, the crystals still make light bridges. Now the light helps wear them. Smart. Almost there. Allow me. I guess you'll do the rest. I dare say he's beginning to enjoy the vandalism. Pretty soon he'll be laying waste to pottery. Shall we continue? Well, at least we're getting closer. Look up. See? It feels even taller on the inside. I can't believe all this was down here. Oh shit. Ah, <laughs> oh. oh, the Nornir. Why must they insist on these frustrating trials? You would know better than us, brother. I can't remember the last time I visited the Norns. Nor do I wish to try. <laughs> Um, well, there's a chest down there, but where's the third bell? One, two, three, okay. What? It's nice seeing it again. Oh, I have to ring it. Got it. Well done. Apple of Eden. Uh, now we go down, we get that chest. God damn. He's gone. Ugh. No. Fuck. What the fuck? Where did that thing come from? Oh, he's dead. What the 
Holy shit. These are all just for combat, right? Brighter than I remember. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's so dope. I gotta remember that next time. I didn't realize that's what they were all for. I thought you just had to like look at one and bounce it. Okay, let's go. Another light door. There's some twilight stone on that statue shield. That angle isn't gonna work. Do you think there's any way to stop Oops. the elves from fighting each other? Had Freyr not abandoned the realm, a lasting peace may have fallen as now. Can we really place all the blame on Freyr? This war started long before his arrival. But he had the power to heal this land and end the war, did he not? He made his choice. The wrong one. Hmm. For Alfheim, perhaps. But not necessarily for him. Well... I suppose we're all entitled to walk our own paths, regardless of where they end. Huh. I missed a little bit of that because I was still trying to figure out the puzzle, but... It sounds like Freya's brother... ...had the power to... ...make it so it wasn't so bad. get to there. I swear to God, if it fucking... What is that? The shield moved. Unless... It, okay. The statue keeps getting stuck on the wing. There we go. That looks right. How are we gonna turn the shield inside out? Tear, the last time we were here, we killed the Dark Elf King. That's unfortunate. I'd wondered what became of Svartli Offer. We had to defend ourselves, but when he died. He told us we helped the wrong side. I see. Oh. I guess it's, uh... <laughs> there we go, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Fine job, brother. This way. We're almost there. Back outside. Do you still hear something wounded out there? I think so. It could just be the storm. Perhaps we can investigate once we've uncovered a mysterious seer's hidden prophecy. There, the central chamber will bring us to the top once we find our way past yet another light door. 
Okay, we got another light door. There's the crystal. We gotta bounce something off to get it to fucking... I don't see anything that's gonna let us bounce it off. Take it down. Uh. There's some soundstone up there. It pairs quite nicely with the Twilight Stone. A knack for interiors, these light elves. Uh, it's facing the wrong way. Hmm. Maybe if we. Allow me to speed this up. Oh, all right. The angle should work, Kratos. Well done. At your service. Hell yeah, man. I'm glad we brought you along. Ah, the light of Alfheim. How stunning. Nothing. What's wrong? I could hear Mother inside last time, but I can't anymore. Her soul is one with the light now, united by forces older than Odin himself. She is huh. at peace, Atreus. I hope so. When Father went inside the light, he you said he- went inside the light of Alfheim? Yes. And yet here you stand, of sound mind and decidedly not incinerated. You must tell me, Kratos, what did you see? That memory is for me alone. But I felt only moments pass. Didn't feel like moments to me. I was trapped. Atreus overcame great odds to save me. One could but only imagine. Well then, Groa's triptych awaits. So, did you ever meet Groa? Many times. But she was plagued by constant visions, so... Conversation was... Difficult, to say the least. Was this the spot? She's... she's gone. Yes. Keep moving. We're almost there. Huh. They've changed some stuff. Yeah. Last time, there was all this hive stuff up here. So many dark elves. I... All this time, I thought the dark elf king... I thought all the dark elves were... Dear. Yeah. We helped our own side. Hmm. Are you certain that's the right question? I... What's the right question? Is there a right side? Exactly. Hmm. What do you think, Atreus? Is there a right side in this war? I... I don't know. Then perhaps you shouldn't pick one. Very interesting. Then you got those fucking assholes who are like, Indecision is a decision. 
Not making a move is a big move. What the fuck am I doing? Thought this was a puzzle. Didn't realize we're just going into the next door. I guess we're going right. And this is how we got out last time. And... Of course, Brock and Sindri are here. There it is. Ah, you all made it. Welcome. Must have missed something. Would have been a shame to have left that behind. Do you believe in fate, Sindri? Oh, of course not. You think I'd wash my hands this much if I thought that what I do doesn't ultimately matter? There's only one thing with any say over how we live our lives, and that's us. Hmm. Well spoken. Um, Spalders of Enlightenment. They look kind of epic, but... I don't know, I'm kind of growing attached to the whole one arm or one shoulder piece type thing. And a waist, belt of enlightenment. Still like the need of a leer. Uh what else we got? Artifacts. I'll sell them all. And in pristine condition, too. Okay. The giants always did enjoy hiding their secrets in plain sight. Wait until you see this. Groa's search for her missing husband. She was relentless in her attempt to find him. Meditated for weeks on end. Unfortunately, she found... something else. A vision of Ragnarok. Word of Groa's vision reached Odin. He sought her out. Demanded a private retelling. Didn't like what he heard, apparently. Ironwood? That's the... Huh? I don't know what yep. that is. The mythical sanctuary for giants. Curious. So it's in Jotunheim? I know some giants thought so, but Ironwood isn't anywhere, lad. It's a concept, a metaphorical paradise. It's not real. Presumably, Groa requested her ashes be returned to Jotunheim, while her soul found peace in the light. Difficult to imagine Odin respecting those wishes. Hmm. The champion? I think it's supposed to be... me. You assume huh. too much. Aye. Best not to read into these abstractions so literally. Prophecies are slippery by nature. Although some are more obvious than others. Ragnarok. Aye. The end of everything. So this is it. There's nothing we can do to World stop serpent. it. There must be a way. Why else is this hidden? Look. Here. This is what we saw. It's you. Fighting in Ragnarok. No. I don't. I can't. What's this then? That's new. Asgard is destroyed? But the other realms thrive?
she lied. Roa lied? Of course she did. <laughs> Odin's working off a false prophecy. <laughs> so then, we can win Ragnarok. We can beat Odin. We are not present in any of this. But that was Tyr leading the charge against Asgard. Plus, Hell's army was there. And the elves. Champion. Okay, whoever that is doesn't matter. But for the first time, we know something Odin doesn't. We just saw we can win. Tyr? I won't allow prophecy to define my choices. But, but we just saw No, him. Atreus. This is wrong. Come. There is much to discuss. It is time. What is that thing? We can't stop Ragnarok, but we can win it. If Asgard is destroyed, Odin will not be the only casualty. There must be another way. So, what'd you see? A lot. Roa lied to Odin. Ragnarok isn't the end of everything. It's just the end of Asgard. Just the destruction of an entire realm, is it? To say nothing of its citizenry, its wildlife. Those ignorant and innocent of Odin's misdeeds. Enough. There is much to discuss once we are safe at home. Alright, where's the door? I want to hear this discussion. Perhaps we should focus on our egress <sighs> first. Agreed. What are those light bombs? Careful! Nicely done. Okay. We gotta get to that door quick. I am fading fast. Oh, of course. Goddamn little lizard things. Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit. Let's go. Quickly now before more arrive. Wait, wait, 
Get out of here. We need to keep moving. This way. Light up on the left. Bitch. was extremely uneventful. I did not mean to do that. I got it. Oh, no. Ah, oh, god damn it. I was timing it fucking wrong. There we go. Oh, Tear, you're looking uh, like you might have killed somebody over there. Come on. Piece of shit. You're mine. She's using the light to hear what herself. the? No. <laughs> God damn. Tear, are you okay? No. Far from over. I. It's gonna be okay, Tyr. You've seen what is to come. I told you I would not follow you to war, and yet here I am, dragging an innocent, innocent? elf and marching towards the destruction of Asgard. What choice do we have? There is always a choice. I will not lead you to war. I won't. I'm not that god anymore. I don't want to fight, but with you three, there is no avoiding it. Your path leads to countless deaths, unimaginable pain and suffering. What is about to happen here? Oh no! No! Atreus! Shit! Oh no! What the 
fuck. We just made it all the way up there. Well, I guess we were headed down anyway, huh? Swallowed some souls. Agreed. Kratos' face is a lot more animated hey, in this game. Dear? Thanks. And I'm sorry about before. I, I. No. I am sorry. I should never have come. We shouldn't linger. I want to do the right thing. And according to prophecy... Speak no more of prophecy. War will not give you the purpose you seek, Atreus. Only slaughter. So what are we supposed to do? Roll over? Do nothing? Enough. We will discuss our next move when we are out of danger. Fucking hell, where is this door? I'm so sick of fighting hell. Can't they just leave us alone? Yeah, don't you guys need everybody that you can kind of get? the door or something through here oh my fucking god well that was a waste Come on, Atreus, we gotta go. Oh, we can't. Okay. Clear, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Let's keep moving. Of course. 
Let's fucking get out. I'll meet you on the other side. Oh my god. Keep pushing forward. to fuck these guys up. Yourself the legacy this one has left for the barons. I've had far more than I can stomach. What? We do not need to rush. We should see this desert for ourselves. Yeah. Look, I know we can't trust prophecy, but I'm not sure we should just ignore what we saw either. We are not ignoring it. We will discuss it back home. For now, I wish to search for the wounded animal you heard earlier. You? Really? Yes. Well, okay then. Maybe in the next one, but I'm fucking... I'm out. I'm taking a break.